Hello everyone, welcome once again. This is me Anwar and this is my new Microsoft Word tutorial for you all. In this tutorial, I will proceed my previous video and I will make two more professional tables for you. So let's start. But before starting the lecture, if you didn't subscribe our channel, please subscribe it. Let's start the lecture. Yesterday, we made this table. Okay, now we are gonna to make two more professional tables for you all such kind of tables like uh, this one and this one mm, this one okay so first let's make this one how we can make let's start first you can see how many columns here one two three four and five so let's take five columns five columns and can take five rows and little bit increase the size of the table okay layout and height okay first you can see here is two rows so row span similarly merge cell and now you can see here two columns so the first one merge cells and similarly like this one okay now you can see it's almost done you can just copy and paste the text i already made it so let's copy the text from here control c and to here control v okay and also i already set the text if your text is like here then you can set your text and the middle okay then for this you can copy this text and paste it here control v if similarly if your text is here you can make it into the center okay then copy this all text Control C and Control V. It's all done. Now you can see here in this table, it's not look like this one. Okay, so how you can do this? Select the table and come to Design and Border. You can just leave bottom border and top border and remove all the borders. Left, right, and inside borders and now it's done so now it's still not like the same this one so you can select these two and again bottom border okay and then select this one with same bottom border and this one as well bottom border now grid lines is uh, here that's why it's not look like the same you can remove the gradients the grid lines okay so now you can see it's look like the same so if you want to see the grid lines then you can select then you can see the grid lines but it's only for text you uh, uh, when you inserted all the text then you can remove the grid lines now look at this one and this one it's so uh, only one thing is remaining that is you can insert the caption insert the caption okay and it's actually table you can set two and you can insert the caption like this one control c and you can insert it now it's all done okay if you are writing a note so you can also write a notes here like this one like this one the note okay so you can write a note here so now it's done we did it now let's make another one so now let's make a table like this one so you can see one two three four five six seven seven columns 
come here and gain seven columns okay and some rows and increase similarly increase the height okay so now let's copy this text and paste it here okay so I will copy from here copy this text control C and paste it here and these columns in the past column okay so come here and it's actually black and the text style is time new roman okay it's done now you can see here is one two three three rows for undergraduate so we will call span and then we will merge the cells and again we will merge the cell for master and similarly tab and again tab and again tab okay so let's do let's come here and split the table uh, page break so or we'll start from here then come here again and merge cell okay now you can see similarly copy all those text and paste it here okay let's copy this one undergraduate control C and paste it here control V it's uh, actually similarly the problem is white so you can make it here a little bit crease okay undergraduate and again it's time new roman okay and make it into the center okay here and then copy all this text control c and paste it here control v and again here text is white so make it black and then time new roman and now it's you can see it's in the middle yes it's in the middle so it's done now again and it's master students control c and paste it here control v and again you can make it into blank and time new roman okay and into the center okay and then copy this text control c and paste it here control v and similarly the text is black and time new roman and it's in the middle and for a phd copy this text control v and select the text it's black time new roman and then select the text control c and control v and black and time new roman now you can see it's done you can insert the caption from here insert caption and okay and it's table tree okay insert the caption and if you want to write a note here actually this one is in the middle and a note here then you can click here and copy this text control C and control V now you can see it's like similar like this one okay this one so you did it that's all for today in our next video we will start how to insert a line picture shapes smart art and all other things so let's tune with me thank you so much